Hey guys, and welcome back to Condemned 2. Titan here, of course. When we last left off, we were heading to the museum. We got the skin peeled away, strips of muscle torn from bone, and her head. Is oh, delicious. How'd you make an ID? Well, she was wearing this badge. <laughs> oh, well. Apparently, she was visiting the museum director to discuss delays regarding the grand opening. Media? Damn. Expect a maelstrom any minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Someone knows. First Van Horn, and now... Keep your voice down. Agent Thomas? Mr. Thomas. <laughs> Mr. I found this on the body. <laughs> Ooh, how? Mmm, we've seen those eyes before. SKX, you say? Mr. Thomas, take a look around. Dolan and I are heading back to the agency. <laughs> what a prick. Remember our discussion. I'm trying to protect you. Yes. Well, get this to Agent Rosa, SCU ASAP. I'll have it delivered right away. We'll trust him for now. Although Dolan. <laughs> he looks like a fucking toad or something. That amuses me greatly. So, we've got our maximum sneak ability, which... Uh, it's alright, I guess. It's not... Um, it's not as good as you might imagine. Alright, Chief, what's going on? What have we got here? Missing... Uh, yeah, she's... Uh, too little blood. Could be splattered all she's definitely missing her head. That's for sure. All right, well, I guess we better do some investigatory work. Oh, hello. Whoa. Looks like the perp used the wheelbarrow to transport the Mhm. Mm Doesn't it just? Well, let's study the evidence. Let's get our blue light majig out. Yep. She definitely came from there. So, determine where the wheelbarrow came from. I can do that. I think oh, this looks rather likely. So tire trail to the pallet, the street, the wall, the trail to the door, the trail to the boxes. Uh, well, that that certainly looks like a door to me. And yes, my timer is going. Excellent. Um, okay, so I guess we're looking at a door using all the powers of our brain here. A bloody tire trail. Certainly suggests an actual crime scene and possibly Well, we should hope so. Doesn't mean dick to me. That's the spirit, Thomas. Damn though. Slashed up pretty hard. Got like an X on her back. Oops, don't want to punch a corpse now. Like she had something removed. I don't know. Yeah, looks like she had pieces cut out of her. That's yeah, probably not important. Right, okay, mister. Let's have a little lift up, shall we? There we go. Up and over. Yes. I'll take that under advisement. Right, optional. Do not kill any guards. Well, we're not going to. Um, incapacitate without killing. Uh, use only fists when fighting guards. Once a guard is defeated, uh, in a defeated state, grab him by the neck to incapacitate. Okay, seems uh, fairly logical. We we don't want to be uh, to be murdering any innocent people. But is there anybody ever truly innocent? I don't know. Probably not. We've all done silly shit. Now. And if you haven't, you haven't lived. Right, so basically, the rule of thumb with the whole sneaking thing, if we gently push forwards, we are now sneaking. If we can hear our footsteps, the enemy can hear our footsteps. So... 
I mean, that is as fast as we can sneak, and that is gold level. So, kind of useless, really. It's, it's not that good. Um, there are a couple of upgrades that we do get that really aren't fantastic. They kind of feel more like filler than anything else. Anyway, let's keep following this blood trail. So, what have we got here? Paleontology lab. Ooh. This is cool. So this museum is due to be opening soon. Uh, I think it's about to have a minor setback. Okay. Um, not that I can see the future or anything. It just seems uh, that having a dead stiff, you know, stinking up the joint is going to set things back somewhat. So what have we got? Small specimen storage. And that's the other other part of the lab. Okay, well. That seems like somewhere we need to go to. What's in this door? We can't open this door because why would we be able to? That would be silly. Right, let's run. Let's go. Now. Oh, hello. I just received that little present you sent me. It's a bit disturbing to think that SKX is still alive. Last time I saw that psycho, half his face lined the inside of a trunk. Mm -hmm. Well, the body was never recovered, so I guess the chance he survived was always there. Yeah, I mean, if you remember the end of the first game. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, um, if you remember the end of the first game, it's kind, of, <laughs> it's kind of hard to see how Serial Killer X could have survived, but uh, hmm, who knows? Ah, I am also drinking coffee laced with rum, so this recording session might get more interesting as we go. Uh, it's also pissing down with rain for the first time in months in the UK, and my god, am I glad to see it back. To walk quietly, push slightly on the left stick. If you can hear your footsteps, so can the enemy. Yeah, and as we've seen, considering we've got gold level. Yeah, it, it's kind of not that useful. Generally, once an enemy has seen us anyway, we're, we're hosed. One of you is going to get it tonight if you're not careful. My friend. <laughs> well, maybe, my friend, maybe. But that's what makes life interesting. Am I right? The possibility of uh, getting it, should we say. And not necessarily a good okay, it either. So far. The victim is Mayor Rachel Mars, age 55, found dead inside the City Museum of Natural History. Body has severe lacerations about the back, chest, and arms, resulting in excessive hemorrhage. Mm. There's also an extensive tearing of muscle and ligament within the same region. Head decapitated just above the collarbone. Whereabouts is still unknown. All right, and now for the note you sent me. Found on the victim's body was a piece of paper with strangely drawn eyes on one side, and on the other, the acronym of a serial killer known as Serial Killer X. Both written with a black felt tip. Pen. Yep. Hmm. Did you find any fingerprints on the paper, I believe? Did you find any fingerprints on the paper? Yes. I ran it through IAFIS, and guess whose name popped up? Leland Van Ooh. Horn. Ooh. I don't need to tell you this, but let's make it official. Leland Van Horn, a.k.a. Serial Killer X, or just SKX, was allegedly responsible for nine serial murders in the greater metro area. He's the nephew to Malcolm yep. Van Horn and was thought to be dead, killed by a gunshot to the face. His body was never recovered. Uh-oh. Do you think Van Horn nursed his nephew back to health? I think that's most likely. Do you think he faked his injury? Uh, no, he definitely didn't fake his injury because if I remember correctly and I'm pretty sure I do we were there do you think he managed to recover from the injury on his own possible but the logical choice of course is the top one 
think Van Horn nursed his nephew back to health? I'd say it's the most likely scenario. I have a theory. SKX gets one in the grill. His own flesh and blood, Malcolm Van Horn, nurses him back to health. SKX turns on his uncle and kills him. For perhaps the same reason he murders Rachel Mars. Hmm. Keep searching the museum. We need more information. Okay, now we don't have a huge amount to find here. We've all already got most of our responses. There's two antennas. Uh, I'm pretty sure the antennas are... F I don't want to say it in case we do miss them. I do have a guide up, but the guide is pretty rubbish. And I don't want to look away and miss something again. Like the end of the last video. Mm. Right, study evidence. Let's photograph the saw, shall we? Ooh, this thing looks pretty damn badass, doesn't it? Right, well, let's get our camera up. There we go. Now, unfortunately, our unlock for this level is not overly useful, I don't think. Now, we've got to get the saw. So, there we go. That should... Be a good shot, hopefully. Good work. Nice. An odd shaped saw. Looks medieval in origin. Medieval. Get a shot of the handle, will you? Okay. Now I'm not an expert photographer, but we shall give it a go. Come on, focus. What happened to autofocus? Especially on these little compact cameras. There we go. That look that looks pretty good. Oh, look, fingerprints. Let's go for those bad boys. Got Excellent. Excellent work. That, that. A fingerprint. Give me a moment. Okay, over 50% hmm. of the fingerprint found on the handle is compromised by smudging. However, after running the print through IAFIS, I'm able to get a positive match on our suspect, SK. Excellent. I'd say SKX is very much alive and is now the prime suspect in the murder of Rachel Mars. Uh okay. What about the saw? You said it looked evil. Uh he said it looked medieval. You said it looked ancient. Now if we was paying attention we, we will know she was saying it looked medieval. That I do like that, that one. It looked evil. Um yeah, we, we can pretend, we can pretend uh Thomas is too drunk uh to remember correctly. But no, of course it is medieval. What about the saw? You said it looked medieval. Talk again drunk. Yeah. I hear the museum will feature one of the largest medieval exhibits in the country. Yeah. Ethan, find the exhibit that tool came from. SKX was certainly Ooh. there at one point. Yes, he certainly was. I'm going to put that over there. Okay, so locate the exhibit. Um, okay. Now, the tool exhibit. Now, before we do that... Lith cams. Okay, so we have some cameras here. Um, I don't know if we're sequence breaking anything here. Because we know this game doesn't like that. Okay, let's just go for this. Hopefully we haven't broken anything. So we've got a camera ID. That is fifteen oh one, so fifteen oh one. Okay, hold on a sec. Camera one five zero one was installed a week ago and just completed its forty eight hours. That'll do. Ethan, if you think SKX may be on camera, find the surveillance room and let's take a look. Well, it's pretty bloody logical to assume so. I mean it's right in uh right in full view of the camera, let's be honest. Okay, so What's down here? I guess a big fat load of old nothing. Alright, Thomas. Well, we're not going to worry about that just yet. Let's keep moving. Hmm. This place is supposed to open in a week, you say? I'm sure they said a week. There seems to still be a lot of work that needs to be done here. Now, I'm not a, a, a builder or an architect. But... It seems logical there's a lot more work that needs to be done yet. Ooh, we've got some bricks. Are 
Anybody here? I hope not, because we're making a fuck ton of noise up here. Oh, hey, buddy. Don't mind the flashlight that's flickering and shining down on you. Yes, it's probably just rats. Probably just rats or nothing. Uh oh. Oh. I have a feeling things are about to get a lot more interesting. Right, anyway, we want to... We can jump down, like, pretty much any of these, I think. Ooh. But we want to avoid weapons for now, and we want to jump down this one anyway. Not bad, Ethan. Not bad. And here's our first antenna. So what have we got on the box? Good evening, this is Sarah Brayton, City News. With her head reportedly missing, Mayor Rachel Mars is dead. Her decapitated body was found earlier today at the Museum of Natural History. Apparently she was murdered, suffering extensive cutting about her body. There are no leads as of yet, but the federal and local authorities have cordoned off the area in an attempt to locate the perpetrators of this heinous crime. More after this. Well, that news certainly got around quick, didn't it? Okay, fair, fair. Oh, bloody hell. You alright, Chief? You're just trying to kick my ass? I like the way we're not actually allowed to hurt these guys either. Ooh, nice try, buddy. But we've got like a knife between our... Yeah, you point at me all you like, you dick. I have been brought up on these mean streets. Sleep time, my little friend. Sleep time. Now, later on in this level, if, if memory serves, uh, the enemies will... Well, you get the normal crackheads and all. Now, they will fight the guards. If they kill the guards, it doesn't matter. It's, it's all gravy, baby. Ah, oh, yes. Fuck yeah, baby. <sighs> A nice drop of the old deer hunter. Lovely. All right, let's go. Yeah, everything looks pretty quiet so far. Men's locker room. Anything in the locker room? Apart from that knobhead. Oh, looks all quiet from where I'm standing. What's this one? Just close that door. Uh, surveillance office. That's where we need to be. Mm hmm. We're not going to pick up any weapons, like I say, because if you have a weapon in your hand, you can kill the guards, and that won't lead okay, to us getting a gold Find medal. Drive and let's see if our madman has made a oh, let's hope so. Let's see, what have we got here? It was camera 1501, wasn't it? There we go. Okay, the feed is coming in now. There he is. What a, what a big saw you have there, sir. All the better for slicing on heads. Slicing on heads? Slicing off heads. Mm. <laughs> I like the way he picks her head up. Wow, disturbing, but not overly revealing. Keep looking for the exhibit. I'd be fine. Ooh. Okay. Slimy yet satisfying. I do like the way he picks up that, that head and, and, and uh, gestures it to be quiet. It, it's quite cute in a way. Uh, I'm not a monster. We don't want to go into the meeting room. Yeah, one of these doors, actually, if memory serves, you can fuck everything up. Because there's a guard, and I believe he's got a gun, and you you have to take him down. Um, oh, evening. Bloody hell, we got a champion here. Look at this guy. This guy's a badass. Come on. Now, you're lucky you're fighting me, my friend. Because if this was anybody else, you wouldn't be going home to little Timmy later. There you go. Just be thankful I'm a kind-hearted soul. 
and I want that gold medal. That is your saving grace this day. Uh, I can't actually remember where where the next. Where the next um, antenna is. I'm pretty sure the antennas are quite easy to find. Wow, they've done some damage here. Hey, it's a T-Rex. At least it was a T-Rex. Whoa, they've even broken the T-Rex. I mean, honestly, guys. Seriously? Do you have no appreciation for history? Well, at least we can beat some lessons into them. Looks like they're going to be sorely needed. That is if they survive their lessons, of course. Oh, hey, pal. I can see you there. Whoa! You got a hell of a reach on that thing. I'm not going to be dancing with you, sir. At least, not in a manner that... Alright, I've had enough of your bullshit. Ouch! You're kind of kicking my ass here. Nice try, buddy. There we go. In fact, you, sir, I've had just enough of your bullshit. There we go. What the hell is going on here? Okay, I think we just, like, broke his arm. Which was very much enjoyable. <sighs> I like breaking their arms. What happened to your weapon, actually? Pretty sure you had one. Now, we've just taken a bit of a kick in which could have been could have been better I'm not gonna lie ah, medieval wing you say okay Rosa, I found a museum directory. Mm. Good. tell me the area of the museum you want to find and I'll update your uh, we need to find the tools don't we so select the tools and submit got it let me check the blueprints okay Ethan? GPS has been updated. Yeah, this place is definitely not ready for prime time, is it? Let's set it back a little bit further. There we go. <laughs> I do like the way the glass shatters. Just comes away in uh, large chunks. Um, so, there is a particular room that I can't remember where it is. Or well, I can't remember when it is, but it's quite important. Hey, look at this. There's nothing in the display cases at all. I mean, honestly. We really need some health too. The dinosaur area. Details, details, details. Who's been spray painting this place? Ooh, this is. F oh, hello, friend. Nothing to see here, my dude. We're going to have to take this bastard down, aren't we? Oh, there's the other antenna. Well, that was a lot easier than I thought. Um, let's sneak up on this son of a bitch. See if we can't donkey punch the fucker in the back of the head. Oh, okay. I did not know we could do that. Good night. Uh-oh. I saw that. Yeah, it's probably nothing. Probably my imagination. Most likely. I do have a very active imagination. This is true. Okay. Let's get our last antenna. No. At the scene is Tony Rhodes. Hey, Tony. Tony, what do you make of this? Tony? Yes, sir. I'm now a block away from the museum and have seen the unthinkable. Peering away from the museum, arms loaded with priceless objects of antiquity. It appears the museum has been targeted by these thieves, some literally wearing artifacts out on their persons. Excuse me, sir. Care to make a comment on the latest event? Thank you, Tony. This is City News. Oh shit. So it looks like things are escalating. Wearing priceless artifacts, eh? Well, I can understand. 
Talking of priceless artifacts, why walk around with a baton when we can walk around with a freaking axe? Right, let's go with a battle axe. It does more damage. Come on, fools. Let me split you in half. Now this. Ooh, hello. Now this. This is going to be good. Ooh. Oh, look at that guard. Guard, you're not going home to your wife. I'm just saying. Or your son, for that matter. Oh. Well, maybe he is. They only pushed him over. Ah, yes. Emitter there. Well, didn't really want to do this. God damn it. It's fine. It's fine. We can recover. We have, you know, a broadsword. There we go. Great tourist ass track. Um, actually. Broadsword. It was a Jeffro uh, Toll cover, uh, cover, I believe. Didn't quite have the wicked base of the um, the the Jeffro uh, Toll cover, but it was good. It was very good. I mean, it's Terrasas. You know, it's, of course, it's good. Um, I do like covers of old music. Ooh. Dude, my dude, my dude. All right. What have you got? You've got a warhammer. A puny... Oh, you broke my sword. You done broke my sword. Fuck you, pal. You broke my... Give me that. God, he broke my sword. You know, I'm... S Ooh. Oh, I thought that was a tomahawk then, but it's not. What's that? I'm starting to doubt how good these artifacts are. Hello. Hey, no running, kids. No running. I'll be with you momentarily. So I guess it's her running around spraying all the spray paint everywhere. Let me squish your skull. I have the equipment to do such a feat. Excuse me. Hey, love. No? You don't want to play? Fine. That's fine. Just stay out of my way, and you probably won't get hurt. How are we... Uh oh. How are we doing? This might be a good place to save it, actually. Uh, I do actually know where the emitters are, so that's good. There's one down here, actually. Oh, this place is quite tough. Ooh. Ooh, some pills. Just what we wanted. Hmm. That place looks fun. Um, well, we're not going over there. We're going to go down there. But, my friends, that is going to have to wait until next time. Because we're out of time here. Now, at least we have the, uh, the Cranium Crusher here. This weapon is a lot of fun. Um, unfortunately, I say the weapon's a lot of fun. If if I had to critique the, uh, the the weapons in this game, they do mostly feel the same, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but this thing does look menacing. I mean, for fuck's sake, it's a warhammer. Quiet, Windows. It's a warhammer, so you know it's going to be fun. Now, you could certainly chip some teeth with this thing. And crush some craniums, which is exactly what we're going to do in the next part. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.